Adana kebabi, colloquially known as kima kebabi is a long, hand-minced meat kebab mounted on a wide iron skewer and grilled on an open mongol filled with burning charcoal. The culinary item is named after Adana, the fifth largest city of Turkey and was originally known as the kima kebabi lit, minced meat kebab or kima in Adana Mersin and the southeastern provinces of Turkey. History Kebabs are usually made out of ground lamb meat and tail fat, though there are many regional variations. Kebabs are fairly common in the area from Mersin in Turkey to Kirkuk in Iraq, and includes Aleppo in Syria. According to many authors, this kebab was born out of a fusion of Turkish and Arab cultures. Beresik, once an important locality in the islet of Aleppo, is said to be the creator of this very kind of kebab. The version prepared and consumed today in the province of Adana also has a history rooted in the modern Turkish culture, only to receive a controlled designation of origin in February 2005, after subsequent legal trials. Geographical distribution Original geography According to the patent registrar, an original Adana kebabi is made only by a vendor who has successfully passed an inspection conducted on the spot by the Adana Chamber of Commerce. A substantive list of these establishments can be found here. The kima kebabi is still prepared in its historical location. Similar dishes are prepared in neighboring zones of Turkey, Syria and Iraq, where the meat is hand ground with the addition of tail fat and occasionally a non-spicy capsicum. <laughs> Recent geography and misconceptions New variants of the kima kebabi, not protected under the same patents, have been enjoyed since the 1950s, in communities in the former Ottoman Empire territories, including Istanbul, Baghdad, and Damascus. These versions are adapted to the local tastes and cannot be considered the original kima kebabi. In Istanbul, and other Turkish communities outside of Adana and Aleppo, a kima kebabi is either an Adana kebabi, the spicy variant, or an Urfa kebabi, the non-spicy one. The original Adana kebabi was not spicy at all, and Urfa kebabi did not exist, even in Urfa, where the local variation of kima kebabi is called hashes kebabi. Preparation Mincing and kneading According to the designation of origin, Adana kebabi is made from the meat of a male lamb that is younger than one year of age. The animal has to be grown in its natural environment and fed with the local flora. The meat should then be cleansed of its silver skin, nerves, and internal fat. After the cleansing, it should be cut into rough shanks and, along with tail fat at a proportion of 1 to 5, be laid to rest for a day. The next day, the rested meat and fat must be ground by hand, using a crescent shaped iron cleaver known as the zur. Only sweet red peppers also hand chopped with the zur and salt should be added. The designation of origin also authorizes, under certain circumstances, the addition of spicy green capsicum and fresh garlic cloves. The meat will then be thoroughly kneaded together with the fat, the salt and the additional ingredients until reaching a homogeneous consistency. Topic: <laughs> Impaling After reaching homogeneity, the mixture is placed on iron skewers that are 0.5 cm thick, 3 cm wide and anywhere from 90 to 120 cm long. One portion of Adana kebabi is typically 180 grams of meat on one skewer. A portion and half Impaled on slightly wider skewers can not include less than 270 grams. As per the designation label, a little water allows the minced meat to adhere better to the skewer, which is the hardest step in the making of this kebab. If not done properly by an USTA, the meat will separate from the skewer during roasting. Topic: <coughs> Cooking. <coughs> The impaled skewers are roasted over flame-less coals of oak wood. 
When the meat turns dark brown, it is ready. The skewers are frequently turned during this process. The melting fat is collected on flatbread by pressing pieces of flatbread against the meat as it roasts, this also serves to heat the bread. <laughs> Serving and eating The kebab is commonly served on a plate, as a porcion, or wrapped in flatbread, as a durum. Porcion The kebab is served over the flatbread used to catch the drippings. It is accompanied by roasted tomatoes, green or red peppers and julienned onions with parsley and sumac. Other typical mazes in Adana Mersin served with the kebab include red pepper esme with pomegranate molasses, fresh mint and tarragon leaves, braised shallot hearts with olive oil and pomegranate molasses, pickled small green chili peppers, and, around Mersin, green shallot stems with slices of bitter orange, citron, lime and lemon. Many restaurants around Adana will also bring hot hummus with butter topped with pastirma on the side, the way to eat. Porcion is to skin and crush the charred tomatoes and peppers into a paste, to put them in a piece of flatbread with part of the kebab, topped by a generous pinch of the onion sumac parsley mixture, and to wrap the whole thing into a few small thick durums. Iron and salgum are two staple beverages consumed with kebab in daytime. On hot summer evenings, ice-cold reiki alongside salgum is often preferred. Durum. The brown kebab is taken out of the mongol, removed from the skewer and placed on top of a large loaf of flatbread mostly lalas or tirnik padesi, topped by a pinch of julienned onions, small diced tomatoes, some parsley, then sprinkled with a little salt, cumin and sumac and finally wrapped into a long roll. Iron is more commonly consumed with durum compared to the salgum. Variations. <inaudible> 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 Many variations of the kima kebabi, all based on hand-chopped lamb meat and tail fat, are found around the Cilician and Mesopotamian parts of the former Ottoman Empire. Some notable regional examples are <laughs> Adana Mersin Metrolik kebab, a recent specialty that saw the light thanks to some of most famous USTAS chefs of Adana. It is nothing but a very long thick kima kebabi that can be 1 to 10 meters, depending on the number of guests on the table. The iron skewers are both long and heavy some weigh up to 15 kilograms and specially crafted. Beatty, a take on the famous Beatty of Istanbul. Parsley and fresh garlic cloves are chopped alongside the meat and the fat instead of capsicum. Kebab tarsisi, more common in the eponymous city of Tarsus, this kima kebabi includes only minced onion with the meat and the fat. Gaziantep, Aleppo Sanlirfa Hashes kebabi or kebab kechkish, very famous in Nizip, Urfa, Beresik and Aleppo, this is a very simple form of kima kebabi, that can at times contain a hint of kal fat and crushed walnuts, making it crispier. Simit kebabi Antep, Oric kebabi Kiles, or kbt mashwit halip, is a distant cousin of the kima kebabi and includes, per kilo of meat, one glassful of soaked bulgur, a few shallots, 30 grams of pine nuts and only 100 grams of tail fat. Different herbs and spices such as dried mint flakes, paprika powder, sumac and cumin may be added to the mixture to taste. Fistili kebab, a speciality of Antep that has around 150 grams of coarsely ground pistachio kernels per kilo of meat and fat. Sebzeli kebab, another specialty of Antep where red and green peppers as well as onions and parsley are hand chopped together alongside the meat and the fat. Iraq <inaudible> <inaudible> Sulaymaniya kebabi or kebab slimanit, an Iraqi variety, that differs from the classic Adana kebabi in a few ways, notably the fact that no pepper or spice whatsoever is added to the mixture, which is also roasted in a very special mongol that has a powerful blower mounted on one side, which raises the temperature of the charcoal. The result is a quite uncommon but very tasty kima kebabi that has a kind of glazed and crispy outer crust. Uh, 
Topic: Events. Adana Kebab has been celebrated as a festival in Adana since 2010. Adana Kebab and Salgam Festival emerged from a hundred year tradition of enjoying kebab, with liver, salgam, and reiki. The event turned into a nationwide popular street festival. Street musicians playing drums and zirna entertain visitors all night long at the second Saturday night of every December. See also Kebab Kubade Kima List of kebabs Notes <laughs>